Marina Barbora, congratulations on taking out the Australian Open Women's Doubles Championship. Just tell us about the feeling right now, holding that trophy in your hands. It's amazing. I mean, it's uh, it's really nice. And after playing last year, the final, we are so happy that we have the title. It was really big fight, and uh, we needed to push push hard. So it's really excited. It's it's really good. And Barbara? Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm extremely happy because you know, like after after so many tries that we tried here, we we finished a couple times in semis. Last year we finished in finals, so you know, just to get, you know, again, like all the way to the finals and finally making it, it's, it's perfect. It's a huge, it's a, like a huge, um, huge, I would say relief. And I mean, we just extreme, I mean, we just extremely happy that, you know, that it's, it's finally our trophy. Great. We'll start with questions in the room. English. Thanks, Matt. You talked about that relief and that you've tried so many times here. Was that crossing your minds in the third set when it was 5-2 and then they started to get a bit closer to you that, you know, here we are again, here's our chance. Was, did, it, did it make it harder to close it out or anything like that? No. Mm, not no. really, yeah. I think <laughs> we were just fighting, you know, just, yeah, just try to win every point and also I didn't have it on my mind. It was just, just fight. We were in here last night talking to Ash Barty after she won and she has now won all of the, her slams on three surfaces and you guys have now done the same thing as well. Mm -hmm. Was that a, a motivating factor for you to, because you've had so much Grand Slam success before, to win ones that you hadn't won and maybe try to start to complete your set? Well, I think we are not really thinking this way. We are not really thinking about it. I think it's amazing what we what we achieved and how you know how good we are and how how well we played uh, this year, also last year, all the seasons that we did. So I mean, I'm really proud of us. But you know, I think we are not really thinking this way. We just you know every time we go on a slam, it's a, it's a biggest tournament, and we really want to do well. So I think this is we, you know we try to we try to give the main focus to the to the all the slam tournaments. And I mean, let's see, it would be pretty, pretty nice if we can complete this, but I think it's not on our mind and we're just going to go and just try to play the next slam the best way we can. Any more, Matt? Yep. One more from me and for you, Barbara. Um, I think last year the statistic was you played 100 matches or over 100 mm -hmm. matches because you were doing so well in singles and doubles. Mm -hmm. and it seems to have started the same way for you this season, quarterfinal singles, winning doubles. Mm. Do you think that's sustainable for you to keep playing such a high amount of matches? Because I know you love doubles. So how do you think you'll navigate that this season? Well, I think I can. I think I can. But I mean, also, you know, I, I know it's going to be it's going to be very difficult. And I mean, as I already said, the, big, the biggest focus is on a, on a slam tournament and all the big uh, WTA 1000s. So, I mean, when we're going to play together with Katka, I really want to do well. And, and I mean, we are set for the for the whole season. We have a, we have a goals uh, that we would like to achieve. So, you know, I'm just going to do everything, everything to to make that, to achieve that. And then also I'm 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 going to I'm going to do everything to to add to the singles as well and you know to be successful in both categories. Thank you. We'll go to online English questions. Online English questions, please raise your hand if you have an online English question. We'll start with Courtney Newen, WTA. Hello, ladies. Congratulations on a on a great tournament and a great match. Thank you, um, Katarina. I'm curious. Like, can you just talk through the match a little bit um, in terms of how you were able to turn it around? They're a brand new team, uh, so you didn't have a lot of data points maybe on them. But what do you think was the key to to turning that match around for you guys? Yeah, I mean, it was really difficult match. I think they they were playing really great. They were pushing us, and uh, we couldn't really in the beginning like put put them our game. And they were really really playing great. And actually, everything was coming in from them, so it was really hard to find like our game, our way. But I think the good stuff was that we were keep fighting and we were trying to help each other just to support each other you know it's gonna come it, it it's gonna be good we are still good we are playing and i think it was the key you know we were just keep playing every point and they they went a little bit down they started to do the mistakes we were looking for so uh, i mean it was really good that we we kept fighting and we kept each other helping 
How about you, Barra? Do you think that there were any um, key adjustments that you and, and, and Kaka made to, to, to turn it around? Well, I think, I, I mean, I think that, you know, the girls, they play well, especially the first set. And, you know, everything was going in. And, I mean, we had our chances, but we weren't able to convert them. And, I mean, in the second set, I was just telling Katka, you know, just let's keep going. Let's keep, you know, playing. And, you know, we're going to we're gonna get our chances again. And, and you know, we have to convert them. So I think this was pretty much the, this was pretty much the key in a, in, a, in a second set that we convert the chances. And, I mean, the same thing was, was third set. I mean, this match was really tight and, and it was a really long match. And... Uh, I think it's 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 amazing what you know, f like what all of us did during the doubles, and I mean I'm yeah I'm, I'm very happy that you know we were we were the one that that are, that that lifted the trophy at the end. I incredible lob to to finish <laughs> things off there, uh, finishing it off in style. Can you talk through that match point? It was very it was very entertaining. Uh, oh, thank you. Okay, thanks. So, I guess we're gonna. You know, I guess we're gonna just talk to, to talk to our opponents more about you know this kind of a this kind of a situation, so we can you know play this more often, so it's more ent entertaining. <laughs> no, I mean, uh, you know, it was just it was a point, and you, I mean, you you want you want to win the point, and you know, if this is the way how you how you have to win the match point, I mean, you just you just gotta you just you know you just gotta go and you just gotta play it. So, I mean. I mean, I can, yeah, like, I mean, I can say that, you know, this was pretty much my game when I was, like, under 12. Because, I mean, we had a tournament back back home, and, you know, the girls, they were they were quite small. Because, yeah, because we were young. And yeah, she was killing me with that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, they've been, like... <laughs> they've been, like, courts that, you know, didn't... They didn't really have that, you know, they didn't have, like, the... the, the sp that much space. Like, there was a fence, you know, really, like, three meters behind the baseline. So I mean, you know, playing this when you know all the balls, like all all these loops, when they when they bounce, they were just like coming over the fence. So <laughs> yeah, like I was kind of I was kind of good in it, and then I mean, then I had to then I had to change and you know play a different game, but I'm still happy that I still have it in me, and and I mean, you see, like balls like this are winning the are winning the the trophies. So I mean, it's really important to know everything. Absolutely. Okay. Um, Sorry, can I have one more? Yeah, last one. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, no worries. Uh, Katarina, well, this is either f for either of you, but does this feel any different or special or anything compared to your your previous major titles? I mean, you you guys are winning them at a pretty good clip. Uh, does it feel like something that you're used to doing, winning <laughs> Grand Slam titles, or does this feel still feel? like a, a special accomplishment no of course you are not used to it you need to work hard for it you practice every day so i think as we said already we were fighting hard to get the australian one so it's it's just really exciting and super happy because the focus on the grand slam as barra said you want to get these titles the big ones so i'm just extremely happy that we got it Perfect. Thank you, ladies. Congrats. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.